Okay, I wanted to talk. There was a movie I saw yesterday that I'd never seen before, even though I own it on DVD. Um, Dracula's Daughter, which was the sequel to 1931 Dracula. It was made in 1936, I believe, and, and they played it last night on Spanguli. Um, and now that there's lowcast.org, I'm able to watch Spanguli because I don't have regular TV, I don't have cable, but I'm able to watch it through the internet. Um, and it, it was quite an interesting movie, but to me the fascinating thing, and this is something that I've seen in two sequels to great, iconic monster movies of the 30s, that is just absolutely fascinating, and that is Reality Check. Two movies from the 30s, Son of Kong and Dracula's, both of them involve a child of, of the previous monster. Um, one a son and one a daughter and they both begin with the reality check like Son of Khan which is I love Son of Khan because it's a sh nice short movie that you can like just get through and you know it's I, I although King Kong is my favorite movie it's really long you know it's about 105 long but Son of Khan is like 67 minutes long or something you know so anyway <laughs> it starts off like right where King Kong ends and now like Carl Denham is like Oh, he, he's being sued by all these, you know, he has to face reality after he brought King Kong to Manhattan. And I'd seen that many times, that's, that's, that, but like the, the similarity here with Dracula's Daughter is that it begins with Professor Van Helsing um, having to face the music that he just killed Dracula and... You know, what does that mean? Does that mean that now he, uh... <laughs> is he, is, did he commit a murder? Because nobody else knows that Dracula's a vampire, right? So, you know, like, it seems like in the movie, here's the big thing. Like, here he just killed Dracula. You know, and that seems to be, you know, that would be the whole point of the movie. You want to kill Dracula, right? And then, like... No, now he has to face the music, and he's either going to go to the gallows or to an insane asylum. Now, as a person who actually works with institutionalized people, both in mental hospitals and in prisons, I have I have uh, encountered people who actually believed at the time that they killed vampires. Unfortunately, very sad, horrible stories that that so. Um, that's a that's a fascinating thing that you know reality. I mean, that would be the reality. Like, let's say there really it really was Dracula. He really was a vampire. That doesn't matter. Nobody's gonna believe you. You know. So um, I just found that fascinating. You know. The rest of the movie was interesting too. There was a lot. You know issues of psychology, and there, there was a lot going on in that movie. I'd like to maybe try to sit and watch it again when my kids aren't complaining that they want to watch Hobby Kids TV or whatever. Uh, how come they have so many subscribers and I only have a thousand? I, I appreciate all my thousand subscribers, but the fact of the matter is most of my viewers are not subscribed. So if you're watching this video and you're not subscribed, please uh, take a moment, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell button, and... Uh, and help me get over to uh, 4,000 hours that I need a year, which is a lot. I'm a little bit more than halfway there now. Um, so I can continue to get that sweet, sweet YouTube money. Or I think I actually have a, what do you call it? What's that called? Uh... Patreon account somewhere. I should maybe link to that. Whatever it is. Well, God bless you. Thank you for watching. God bless. Please like, share, and subscribe. And think of more cases where, like, what would the rea what reality would set in in a uh, in a monster movie? You know, after like, uh, are there other examples like this that you can think of? Uh, t talk. Uh, let's talk about that and continue the conversation in the comments below. Thank you very much. God bless. Please like, share, and subscribe. Comment, and we'll see you later. Take care. Time to go. Right. Better turn this off there. Uh, turn off already.